Agro Suede Backyard Garden 107. And welcome everyone to Agro Suede Backyard Garden with me, Mitchell Junior Suede. In today's video feature, I'm going to actually do a request video. Someone asked me to do a video feature featuring the soil flower. From the time it opens up and from the time it closes, and then the process still is actually reach this stage of full grown soil. And this soil is the same one that will be featured in this video. As you can see here, the soil is actually opening up right now. It's getting dark, so now it's opening up. So maybe by tomorrow morning, this flower should open and bloom. So here is the first flower in Agus back is Garden for the season. Now, this flower will eventually drop off. And this is what will remain. The pulp of the soil. This red part there and this other spiky red part there. So one, two, these two different types of parts. They will remain while the flower drop off. And in there, when it's pollinated and so on, the flower drop off, inside there will have a seed pod, which I'll show you as time goes by. So this is it, the first flower of the morning or in the garden. As you can see, the flower opened in the morning and now it's closed in midday. So overnight the um, flower actually fell. Let me see if I can show you the seed pod as it's starting to develop. I don't know if you can see it there, it's actually there. Small, starting to develop. And this is how the soil from flowering. The flower will open up in the morning for the day and then close the day. And overnight it fell out. And um, this is it now. The soil will just have to start to grow and develop. Right, so now this is the soil. So here's the seed pod. See, after the flower drop, it grows out. You can actually leave the soil on the plant till this seed pod turns brown and it starts to open up. But what I always say is that you should have the soil within three weeks of it flowing because that will cause your plant to actually focus on all the smaller soils. So just pick them. Then make sense to them till the seed pod actually turns brown. Although if you want, you could. So now you just remove your pod. This is the technique I normally use to take out the pulp, but I want you to actually observe the seed. So here it is. So this is it. So here is your pulp. And now this is the seed pod. In another video feature, I'll show you how you could actually preserve your seeds. So what I'm going to advise you to do now that you're actually watching this video, if you actually move your pulp, next, actually put these two seeds in the sun in a container. And then I'll tell you what to do with it after. So I'll continue with this video in another video feature on preserving or saving your soil seeds. Thank you very much for subscribing to YouTube channel. Thank you for liking our Facebook page. And if you have any requests, you could actually let us know by sending us a WhatsApp message on one seven six seven six one seven zero two two four. The request will be answered as soon as possible. Although I can't guarantee it will be like the next weekend after you make the request, but I'll try my best to answer your request. Thank you very much. And Agro Sweet is out.